<laughs> well, hi, baby. What you doing? You want to get under the jeep? You want to explain to our people that what we're up to today? We're doing a tummy tuck. Yeah, we're doing surgery on the mistress. When we were making our last video, we got in the rocks. Okay, if you can come down here and take a look at this. You see how the front edge of this skid plate is mashed? And if you can pan to the other side, you might have to go to the other side. You can see how in the rocks we were. Well, because of what we did with this build, we're going to gain ourselves a full three inches of ground clearance underneath. Yes, we're giving it a tummy tuck. So the last time we were in the shop, I had the transfer case out. We took the liberty, taking the skid plate, flopping it down on a piece of cardboard, and making ourselves a template. Now I know you all know where I'm going with this. It's tummy tuck time. Bolt protectors. Okay, uh, now I started doing this without the Jeep being here. I made a cardboard template of the old skid plate, and there's something that may have to happen that I'm just not sure yet. It looks to me like I may have to make a notch for the front drive shaft in case we go into full suspension droop. but. Uh, I'm not real sure of that yet. Something you may be able to do after. After the skid plate is on and just drill a hole and then notch it and grind the edges. I'd like to do it without, but I've got a feeling that we're going to lose a considerable amount here. 
It's right behind you. Yeah. I'm going to use it. Yeah, so you got to love it when that one stray insect does the death flop in your new paint. Even though the paint is just a formality just to provide a rust barrier. Love you. Let the games begin. There you have it. Three more inches of ground clearance. And considerably stronger. Now this isn't really a how-to video. This is a what's possible video. Because unless you're doing the exact same build that I am, this may not work for you. But, if you're doing a 4.7 with a Dodge Ram NV3500 transmission, it all works out with the three inch lift that a flat plate is perfect to get everything in there. So, man, keep on jeeping on. And remember, Jeep, just explore every possibility.